have a new look now at Harry and Meghan's wedding. As they celebrate their first anniversary, we have some brand new pictures from the big day. Errol Reshef here with that. Hey, Ariel. Hey, good morning to you, George. What a year it has been for the royal couple. With the arrival of baby Archie, they celebrated their first anniversary quietly at home at Frogmore Cottage. But now they're giving us all a chance to relive some of the magic of their big day. Harry and Meghan celebrating their first year posting on Instagram never before seen photos from their big day, accompanied by a special tune, their recessional song, This Little Light of Mine. <laughs> Candid shots of the couple so clearly over the moon. We see Prince Harry beaming on his way to church, accompanied by his best man, brother William. Meghan glowing as she talks to her mother, Doria. The bride being handed a bouquet and her veil adjusted before she joined Prince Charles on her walk down the aisle. Some say the Duke and Duchess were thanking all the key players in their special day. For Harry and Meghan, being able to take a trip down memory lane and pick out some of their favorite and unseen moments from the wedding day was a really enjoyable experience. This year has been action packed for Harry and Meghan with a furious pace of engagements, trips, meetings and speeches, promoting the causes dear to them, high among them, shedding light on mental health. This morning, Prince William opening up about the pain he felt over the death of his mother, Princess Diana. I think when you are bereaved, at a very young age, any time really, but particularly at a young age, you feel pain like no other pain. William was just 15 when Diana infamously lost her life in a car crash. The prince speaking in an interview as part of a documentary on mental health, saying that it is particularly British to keep tight-lipped. We are nervous about our emotions. We're a bit embarrassed sometimes. You know, the British stiff upper lip thing, we've just all got to go, let's talk about it. We've got to have that one extra conversation that we might not do. We've got to make that one bit of time mm. to deal with it before moving on. Prince William talking so openly there about his own personal loss, hoping to shatter the stigma surrounding mental health. Of course, as you saw there, it's an issue very high up on the priorities for the royal couple. And they're so comfortable royal, talking yeah, about it now. For sure. And Thank it's you, important. Ariel. It sure is. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.